the African presidents and their countries who sabotaged the United States of Africa, USA idea in the early 60s. The Monrovia Bloc or the Conference of Independent African States in the 60s. These countries and their leaders at the time include Nigeria. Prime Minister Abubakar Tafawa Balewa, Cameroon, President Ahmadu Ahaidjo, Ethiopia, Emperor Haile Selassie, Liberia, President William Tubman, Sierra Leone, Sir Milton Margai, Somalia, President Adan Abdullah Osman Daar, Togo, President Silvanus Olympio, Tunisia, President Habi Bourguiba, Congo, Kinshasa, President Joseph Kasa Vubu, Senegal President Leopold Sedar Senghor, Mauritania Mokhtar Ul Dada, Ivory Coast President Felix Houphouet Boigny, Burkina Faso President Maurice Yamiogo, Niger President Hamani Diori, Benin President Hubert Maga, Chad President François Tombalbay, Gabon President Leon Meba, Central African Republic, President David Dako, the Congo Republic, Brazzaville, President Fulbert Yulu, Equatorial Guinea, Francisco Matias Nguema, Madagascar, President Philibert Tsiranana. These countries and their leaders at the time refused the Union government, under federal system, for their selfish nature. This bloc was driven by a more moderate approach to African unity and cooperation and a gradual approach to decolonization, emphasizing on a phased transition and maintaining strong ties with former colonial powers. While the Monrovia bloc also aimed to remain non-aligned during the Cold War, they were perceived as leaning slightly towards the Western bloc, particularly through their economic ties with Western nations. The Monrovia bloc were pro-colonial powers, mostly French colonies, whilst the Casablanca bloc were determined to wean themselves off the colonial masters immediately. Africa's woes today are as a result of the Monrovia bloc stance. If Casablanca and Monrovia bloc had agreed on the USA idea, Africa will be different today. Thanks.